my heart has been kind of broken for a few months. My and heart. So has my Nick's. heart. <laughs> my heart. My heart. Welcome to another video guys. We are in Florida for Christmas. Um, if you're new to our channel, my name is Chelsea. This is Nick. We have a bunch of pine trees in the back because Nick's family lives on a farm and they do all sorts of things. And so we drove two and a half hours to pick up all of these bags of pines and somehow we fit them in here. I have Hopefully no idea we don't how. get pulled over for like not being able to see out the back. Our fuel mileage probably just went down like 20 miles. <laughs> oh, hi me. Our Christmas this year is in Florida at Nick's parents' house and we have a new addition to the dog family. This is Bella. Oof. And she was found actually under Nick's brother's house. She was like infested with fleas and had like a skin rash and everything. And they've nursed her back to health. All she has is like a little limp and now <laughs> Her and Bear, which is their other dog, play like all the time. Both of you. <sighs> My butt is itchy, dude. I don't know Why are funny. these things making me itch? All right, <laughs> What's up, family? What's up? Welcome back to another video. Today, Chelsea and I are going to talk about what? Oh, hello. My knee just hit the table. You guys are sitting on top of unsweetened iced tea. Yes, I you are. You know that that is very special. Here. And Southern. Uh, today, Chelsea and I are going to talk about, <laughs> we're going to talk about what we got for Christmas. Yeah, which I hadn't done this type of video in years. No. On my own channel that I had for a while. This year, we're at Nick's parents' house. This is where he grew up. Uh, originally, this house was actually supposed to be like a vacation home for the longest time, but they just never moved out of it. And they actually live on a farm. Chelsea and I went through a lot this year, and so it was really different than a lot of other years of our lives, I guess. <laughs> um, we got married. You know, that's kind of a kind of mm -hmm. a thing, kind of a big deal. I think we probably went more places this year than we've ever both gone so that right. was pretty neat uh, but we got a dog we lost a dog we changed our channel this channel to a family channel I honestly kind of hope 2020 is a little less <laughs> eventful in some ways just because so many big monumental moments happened this year and I'm not complaining that's a great thing it's an awesome thing right. but I would love for a little bit more rest Mm -hmm. in 2020 of just like not always being on the go to the next thing because that's kind of how this year felt so we're gonna quickly before our battery dies uh as <laughs> we just oh. realized it turned on we're gonna show you guys what we got for christmas this is kind of like the adult version of all the videos you see of like single girls sharing all the things that they got for christmas and they're like 18 17 18 years old okay we get excited about gift cards oh mama so we're both wearing different PJs. Like Nick has, well, he I have the sweats on. Sweats on, but we both got PJs for Christmas. And then, um, what else we get? What else we get here? We got, uh, oh my goodness, we got, oh my gosh, they just keep falling. <laughs> got some guap, Starbucks. Don't go so fast. Oh, people want to know the amount. We got stuff. Starbucks for I don't know what amount of money. So Nick's grandma is very generous and always. Gives money yeah. for Christmas, which is like that comes in. She clutch. just gives money for any reason. Nara a gift card, Wish which I is could great. Do that. Um, Starbucks. We don't really drink a lot of Starbucks, but we like their tea. Yeah, their tea. Uh, and then Publix gift card, a hundred dollars. This is like two weeks worth of groceries. Grocery? Groceries. Who groceries. Says that? <laughs> Ew, I so I'm like very that excited sounded. about that. Uh, something <laughs> that I'm pretty fired up about, you know really think it, this restaurant has changed the world and will continue to do so. <laughs> Texas Texas Roadhouse, somebody gave him a shout of praise. Yeah. Um, I'll let you do the next one. Cracker Barrel. These are all like Southern. It's a good breakfast date. Type gift cards. Uh, we got a, another Starbucks gift card. I don't know what we're going to do with all the Starbucks. Yes. We, we're getting. Road trips. And then $25 to Jeff Bezos. So that's cool. Maybe next year we'll buy each other Teslas. What do you think? <laughs> if a financial flood comes in, then maybe. <laughs> $300,000 financial blessing. 
I would, oh. would definitely not spend and it on this. Teslas. You got this. Here, show everybody this. My grandma, I, well, it is my grandma now. Yeah. <laughs> Grandma-in-law got me this little uh, necklace that is like adjustable and it's super, super sweet. So it's in here. It's platinum. It's more of like a uh, just subtle jewelry piece. So thanks if you're watching this. I My really Ross appreciate it. But that that's about it. We yeah, don't cool really do. Yeah, cool stuff that. No, we don't, we don't go like crazy. <laughs> you guys may be wondering what we got each other. We didn't really spend money on each other this year. Nick actually got me a gift that was supposed to arrive in like a few weeks and he's been wanting like a knife block so I think we'll probably do that at some point but we're not really huge like gift people it's probably why you don't see very many of these videos on our channel over the past few years uh, where I've done all of like the Christmas shopping videos it's just not a huge thing to us I feel like these times like Christmas is more so just times to cherish with all the family you get to spend with. Hello, we're back after our battery died. But yes, this time of year for us mostly is valuable because of the time that we get to spend with our family and our loved ones. And we just think that that's the most special thing. Um, but more special even than that is the real meaning behind Christmas. Yeah, and we love being able to do a video about like what we got for Christmas and just share with those of you guys who probably don't even celebrate Christmas who are just curious about it, what it actually means. I would say we're not going to sit here and like preach to you guys, but the best book to get started to even understand what Christianity means and why people even celebrate Christmas is John. I really believe that you guys should start in the book of John. There's so much to be learned and I really believe that the Lord will speak to you specifically and uh, tell you things that you've never really even thought of before. In short, I don't want to yeah. just like say hey go figure it out, but in short Christmas is about the birth of Jesus, the one um, who came and did what you and I never could and uh, never will be able to. Sorry. Before Jesus was born, there was 400 years of silence in the actual scriptures themselves. You know, it sounds cliche and more like a tweet than anything, but to think that a baby's cry broke through the silence of 400 years uh, and still speaks and roars and is loud today um, and is intertwined in our life and is actively doing things in our life and in yours, whether you know it or not, is just really really incredible and he didn't stay a baby he grew up and mm. he walked the earth and he taught things he lived out what he said while being on earth and although he did have a short life here he reigns forever with god at the right hand of him in heaven so i just think i just think it's so cool to even be able to talk to you guys about this but we feel like our platform where we share our faith specifically right now is our podcast and if you guys are not in tune with that, we have a lot of new things coming up for 2020 with the podcast and we talk a lot about Jesus and scripture and how that intertwines with just our normal mm -hmm. daily life. Yep. So check it out. It's called Encounter Now with Nick and Chels and we're going to be doing some more videos on this channel in the next coming weeks. Next week we actually have a video about our apartment and like doing the final Woo! tour you gotta watch it and there's gonna be our christmas tree still up even though it'll be past christmas because we like to keep it up for as long as we can and we just haven't been home so we already filmed that video yeah that's the real reason why <laughs> so we hope you enjoy that video and enjoy this one those of you guys who do celebrate christmas i want to know how many do so give this video a thumbs up so that we can see like how many people actually celebrate and those of you guys who don't, let us know down below what else you celebrate maybe or just your faith walk in general. Maybe you're struggling right now and just mm -hmm. want somewhere to confide and we would love to respond to your comment and yes. see what is going on and you can feel free to DM us as well on Instagram. But we love having these conversations. It's honestly one of the biggest reasons we're on social media. So. Mm -hmm. We just love being able to, and I'm glad we got to share what we got for Christmas Me with you guys. Too. Yes. Um, and then a little bit of our like life here in Florida as we're visiting family. It's like a little dog sanctuary around here, man. Yeah, it, it's awesome, especially since like my heart has been kind of broken for a few months. My and heart so has my Nick's. heart. <laughs> my heart. My heart. Chelsea comes to the south for like four days, and my heart. Yeah, but now we have Bella. Not that we're taking her home, but when we get to come back here we'll have all these dogs to love on and yep. so it's 
It's fun times. Yeah. Fun times to be alive. So I'm sorry that this video is not super long or anything super interesting, but we just wanted to say we hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas and that you have an amazing 2020. This is our last video of 2019, which is really cool to just like document and we hope you guys stick with us into the new year and that we get to go through a lot together. Guys, again, thank you so much for watching this video. We hope that you and your family had a very, very Merry Christmas. And to echo what Chelsea said, we hope that you guys have an amazing, amazing new year. We can't wait to join you and have you join us in 2020. Yeah, love you guys. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.